Good afternoon and welcome. I'm Wayne the Train coming to you straight from the heart. Train because I'm a trainer in my real job. Well, today's video is about Amber Alerts. Now, I heard and read that every time an Amber Alert goes on, people call 911 and they complain and they just like go nuts. But what I didn't realize, and maybe you didn't either, is you can actually turn them off. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to do just that. Welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you how to turn off the Amber Alert on your phone. It's really simple and easy. It's four clicks of a mouse or on your phone. But I do want to point out Amber Alerts are there for a reason. Someone's child has been abducted. So it's be kind of cool if you could help them out. You know, like if it was your child, you'd want someone else to help you out as well. I totally get it. I totally need my sleep. I totally need my beauty rest. And I can totally understand, like people are thinking, what am I going to do at 3 in the morning? The alert just wakes me up and I look at it and I just go back to sleep. So I get it. I totally get it. But what I suggest is maybe turn off the Amber Alert at night so you can sleep. But turn it off. Turn it back on during the day because I think it helps others. And, you know, my speculation is people are wondering, why does it always go off at 3, 4 in the morning? I don't know for sure. I don't work for the police, but I think it's a strategy there. I think they want to catch the kidnapper off guard. What happens is you've had a child, you've kidnapped a child, and you've had them all day. You're running around. You're on the run. And finally, at night, you finally fall asleep just due to pure stress and exhaustion. That's when the police want to catch you when you're napping. But that's just speculation on my part. So here's how you turn off the Amber Alerts on your Galaxy. One last caveat. I am using an Android Galaxy 8, Android number 8, right? So I'm assuming it'll work for 8, 9, 10, maybe even 7. But it depends on your phone, okay? So if these instructions don't match. And by the way, way to go Android. Sometimes they change. Sometimes the menu, the menu always changes, and sometimes it's called broadcast alerts instead of amber alerts or something else, all right? So this is my phone, and this is how you turn off the amber alerts. Okay, so the first thing you have to do is open your text message app. I'm sure everyone knows how to do that. It's the blue and white icon on my Samsung 8. Then you click the three dots. It's also known as an ellipsis on the right-hand side, a little halfway up. This will give you a mini menu of four choices. Click Settings. Then you have to click Emergency Alert Settings. And then you click Emergency Alerts. Sometimes this is called Broadcast Alerts. And this will give you the full menu of all the alerts you can turn on and off. All you have to do is click Amber Alerts and you're done. Blue is on and white is off. So as long as it's white, you're all good. Have a nice nap. And thanks for watching.